The Chinese Coast Guard has again attempted to prevent the Philippines from resupplying its troops located on the second Thomas Shoal, blocking and surrounding Philippine supply ships with a series of dangerous maneuvers in a repeat of scenes that played out just weeks ago. The altercation on Friday began when a Chinese vessel approached and radioed the Philippine ship, saying, Philippine vessel, you are approaching the waters of China. To avoid miscalculation and misunderstanding, please inform your intention. Two Chinese Coast Guard ships and 10 maritime militia vessels then became involved in attempting to block the resupply, with footage showing large Chinese ships speeding towards the Philippine boats. In one particularly dangerous interaction, a Chinese Coast Guard ship can be seen heading across the path of a Philippine boat, which had to take evasive action in order to avoid a collision. The resupply was on this occasion successful, despite the Chinese interference. The Philippine ships were attempting to resupply troops located on a grounded vessel inside the Philippine exclusive economic zone that China has claimed for itself. China continues to claim sovereignty over the area despite a 2016 ruling in the Permanent Court of Arbitration in The Hague that found against China's claims. This incident was not as dramatic as the one that took place a month ago, in which China successfully prevented one of the boats from reaching the shoal by firing water cannon onto the vessel. The incident drew widespread criticism, which is likely the reason China has taken to more subdued tactics and interference in this most recent resupply. China responded to this latest incident by saying the vessels had entered its waters without its permission, and claimed the Philippines is attempting to reinforce the vessel with construction materials, which is why they had chosen to prevent the boat's passage. The commanding officer for the Philippine Coast Guard said, We always encounter dangerous maneuvers, shadowing activities, blocking not only from China Coast Guard vessels, but also from China militia vessels. Philippines Defense Chief has also called for a swift modernization of his country's Navy and Coast Guard in order to counter China's aggressive behavior, and said the resupply missions would continue regardless of Chinese interference.